Good evening. Hello, hello. How are you? Good evening, teacher. How are you, Antonio? How's everything? Tell me. Tired? <laughs> tired. Always tired. Uh, but, but today and all Friday, all Friday, my my day work finish at 3.45 p.m. Okay. Every yeah. Friday, repeat after me, every Friday, every Friday, my working day, working day, ends, ends, at three, what? At 3.45 At 3.45 p.m. Yes. Okay, I'll text that phrase for you, okay? Okay. La voy a poner. La voy a it goes like this. You gotta tell me. Every Friday, my working day ends at Forty-five. Yeah, like this. Okay, thanks, teacher. You're welcome. So it's a short day for you. Yes. Okay, that's nice, that's nice. It's good to know that, that you can read. And what about tomorrow? What is schedule for tomorrow? Tomorrow I, I work too. Okay, what's the schedule? What is the mm, start at 7 a.m. and end at 3.45 too. Yes, you get it. Okay, yeah, yeah. Well, and Sunday you read? Yes. Sunday is my day off. Okay, what do you usually do on Sunday? Mm, I like to stay at home, teacher. I like staying at home. Yes. Okay, well, that's I, nice. I, 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 I prefer to read at home. I, I rarely out with my family. But I, I sometimes visit my my mother. Oh, that's nice. Yes. And where does your mom live? My mother lives... Mm, Near Comalapa, do you know Comalapa? Yep. Comalapa La Paz? Yeah, I know. It's near uh, Aeropuerto. Yeah, yeah. I know Comalapa. Romero. Yeah, but it's hot. Mm. Here, here in Zacatecolucas, it's hot too. Oh, yeah, you live in Zacatecolucas, yes. right? Yes. It is very hot. I can imagine. Yes. Yeah, because I mean that's for me. You know, that's difficult because the weather for me is the. Uh, to be honest Where with you, you live? is I live in San Martin. Ah, okay. I live in San Martin, but man, the weather is, I hate it when it's hot. Really? Yeah, I don't like it when it's hot. It's, I like cold weather. For me, cold me weather too. is the best. Me too, I like 
cold weather, but yeah, but it is what it is. It is what it is. I mean, there's no option, right? No option, teacher. No option. And tell me, how big is your family? How many kids do you have? Do you have kids, by the way? Yes, I have a, a son. Okay. He, how, he how old is, is your son? He is age eight years old. Oh, your, your son is eight years old. Yes. Oh my gosh, he's a grown up already. Yes, I remember people. <laughs> yes. Nice, son... nice. My son is 20. 20. Yeah, I am an old man, you know. Yes. Two years. Yeah. Is the difference. Yeah, my son is 20 years old. That's that's the way it goes. You know, time passes for a reason. Yes. Well, Antonio, nice talking to you and welcome to the class. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. It's good to have you here. Okay, let's see who else is around. Let's remind everybody because it's time. It's time, it's time. Uh, Wilfredo, good evening. How are you? Good evening, teacher. Uh, good, good, teacher. Tell me, how was your day? Uh, good. A good day? That's yeah. nice, that's nice. A good day at work. And uh, what about tomorrow? What's the plan for the weekend? What you got for this weekend? Like on Sunday, what are you going to do on Sunday? What you gonna do? Um, no plan for the weekend? Not much, no. Okay, then what do you usually do in the weekend? ¿Qué suele hacer los fines de semana? Yeah, um visiting my family oh where does your family live yeah, soya pango oh, okay that's nice yes okay let's see let's see let's see let's see hello Carlos, no problem. No problem, Carlos. I understand. Well, Wilfredo, welcome to the class. Nice having you here. Let's see who else is around. Uh, Magdaleno, hello. How are you? Hello, teacher. I'm all set to start the class. All <laughs> set. That's the, nice. With the wire, <laughs> fire with the, fighting with the wires. Uh, I know, I know. You get tangled up. <laughs> yes, it's okay. Yeah, no problem. No problem. And tell me. Oh well, weekends uh, are quite busy for you. Yeah, I have a lot of work for the weekend, but I uh, I am busy uh, at the church, at my <laughs> church. <laughs> yeah, yeah, at church. Right now, I know which is your church. It's okay at the church. It's okay, that's fine. Okay, yeah. tell me, would you mind sharing with me your schedule for like for Sunday? Mm, for Sunday, yeah. okay. I wake up at five or six maybe uh, uh -huh. at, at, i have to do cleaning cleaning in in the church and the sanctuary and all the the, the build and the building. 
the, the building. building the building is okay and in all the building and at eight o'clock i i am going waiting for the kids the kids who 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 will who will visit the church to have breakfast with us i have every sunday we have every sunday a milk with cereal to share with oh. the, the, the children it, it is for two hours maybe they have dinner and and then have time to play some time in the playground and uh, and then uh, at the 10 o'clock, 10 in the morning, 10 a.m., uh, we have the service, the Sunday service. And at the 11, 11 o'clock or maybe 11.30, we finish the service and we have time to share with the church, the members of the church. And then we have lunch for everybody, everybody who have to lunch with us. We share um, lunch with around 50 people, including uh, children and an adult. Is right this word, adult? Yeah, adults, adults. Uh, adults, is, is, is that, and then, I we have uh, classes classes with the children and with young people. Um, so, since uh, four four o'clock in the afternoon, and then we have time to play and sh and share with the children and with all other people who came to the church. Only that for the my for my Sunday. Okay, okay, perfect, perfect. Yeah. That's nice. Yes, right. My schedule yeah. is so so busy for the weekend. I can <laughs> tell. <laughs> I can tell, my friend. Yeah. I can tell that your schedule is quite busy. That's right. And you, what what your plans? for for the weekend what you got for the weekend well let's see my heavy day to be honest with you it's gonna be tomorrow because uh i have to do due to a mix up with my schedule uh the problem the situation is this usually on saturdays i teach in the morning at the academy and in the afternoon i teach a private class and mm -hmm. the one that I teach in the morning, it starts at eight. And the place where I go teach is like uh, 10 minutes from my home by car. It's quite close. The problem is that my schedule at the university this semester is Saturday all day. Mm -hmm. So I am, at, I am teaching a class and I got the earphones and I am listening to the, another class. So are you are you studying in uh, in the university? Yeah, I am taking another career because I, I'm an English wow. teacher, right? That's and amazing. right now, uh, right now I am in the fourth year of administration. Yeah, I'm yeah. studying too. In oh, um, really? Yeah, in a seminary, sem and in yeah. a seminary in the United States. I oh, have uh, cool. online classes all Tuesday. Every Tuesday. Every Tuesday, I am. Found, mm. I am. What is the the correct word to say? I am. Yo estoy buscando obtener. I am. Well, in this case, I am trying to obtain. I am trying to obtain my my degree in theology uh, a licentiate that's nice yeah a license a license license like okay. licencia license yeah well 
What do you mean? Oh, no, you want to be a bachelor. Licenciatura. Bachelor. Ah, it's bachelor. Yeah, bachelor. What that That's means? What's... Licenciado. Bachelor. 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 Yeah. Puede escribir, yeah. teacher, esa, esa palabra, por favor, en chat. Exactly as you hear it, guys. It's the thing is this: uh, the the title, that title, uh, exactly as it is, doesn't doesn't exist. Teacher, uh, eso quiere decir licenciado. Yeah, we could say. Mm. Bachelor. The thing is, the thing is this. Uh, Um, how can I explain this to you? The situation is this, that the, the title, uh, the title as, as it is, doesn't, mm, mm, mm. doesn't exist. La cuestión es esta. Eh, el título. Usted no puede, perdón, se lo voy a explicar en español. Usted no puede traducir directamente licenciado al inglés. ¿Por qué? Porque es un título que existe todo en español. Ahora bien, el equivalente sería bachelor, porque cuando uno estudia después de terminar la high school, que es lo que equivale al bachillerato de nosotros, realmente ahí tenemos otro pleito. Because high school starts in nine. La high school comienza en el nueve. Lo que para nosotros sería como noveno. 9, 10, 11 is high school. 9, 10 y 11 is high school. 6, 7 y 8 es junior high school. Junior high. Ok. Entonces, what you study after high school, lo que uno estudia después de la high school, eh, you get a degree, o sea, obtiene un, de, un título o Bachelor, un bachelor, like un bachelor in arts, como sería un licenciado en arte. Cuando son especialidades, you are an engineer, you are a psychologist, okay, you are a teacher. Estas especialidades son directamente el nombre de la especialidad. Porque nosotros decimos licenciatura en psicología, that psychologist. Okay. Allá es simplemente <coughs> psychology. Pero cuando usted no tiene una especialidad de eso, si no se tiene, por ejemplo, como una licenciatura en general, Bachelor in Arts, okay, eso sería el equivalente a licenciado para nosotros. Okay. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's kind, of, kind of different. That's why I tell you, no. the, the closest will be Bachelor. Eso no es, no es, Even eso though, no es in your case, what you are going to become is a theologist. Mm -hmm. A degree in, in theology. Case. Yeah, you're going to have a degree in theology. But your, your title is going to be a theologist. Theologist. It's okay. I'm trying okay. that. <laughs> yeah, no, that's cool. That's cool. I mean, that's your area. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's uh, a... Well, I know it's not your religion, but uh, perhaps there's a word that Catholics use a lot and that applies in your case. That is your calling. El, uh, el llamado is calling. Yeah. It's That's used for calling. me too. Oh, okay. Well, I'm sorry. It's just that I, I don't know that much about the, the, your religion. But as you say, it's your calling. So you feel good doing it. It's something that you enjoy. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, it's it is cool. right. Nice. Magdaleno, as always, a pleasure talking to you. Welcome. Thank you, mister. Let's see, let's see. Uh, 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 um. 
Carlos Josué, hello, how are you, mister? How's everything? Hello, teacher. I'm fine, you? Hello. I'm just fine, just fine. Tell me, what's the plan for the weekend? What you got for tomorrow and Sunday? Uh, I have to work the whole Ooh. weekend. The whole weekend? The whole yeah. weekend, yes. Okay, listen, 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 listen. Check it out. It's like this. The whole, the whole weekend. The whole, the whole weekend. Whole, whole. Whole, the whole weekend. I have to work, yeah. Oh. Uh, even, even on vacation. Oh my gosh. So sorry to hear that. <laughs> Don't worry, teacher. Yeah, but what can we do, right? ¿Qué le vamos a hacer? Yes. Yeah, it, it is a... Yeah, it's I... far of... So, uh, when is your day off? My 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 day off is Monday and and Tuesday. Monday and Tuesday. Usually. Okay. Usually, huh? Well, you know, in a way it's good because if you need to go or to do a transaction, a bank transaction or something, I mean it's working day for them. Yeah, uh, because uh, I don't like to rest uh and Saturday or, or 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 Sunday, I don't like that. I prefer uh, Monday or Thursday. I'm uh, it's good for me. Yeah, we call them weekdays. 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 Yeah, I remember prefer weekdays. Weekdays. Weekday is the other of the semana, and weekend is the other of the semana. Weekdays. Okay. Yeah, the semana. And weekend, fin de semana. Weekend. Sí. Thank you, teacher. No problem, uh, no problem. What about you, teacher? What do you do on, on, on vacation? Well, let's see my projects. Monday, Monday, I need to take my mother-in-law to the doctor, perhaps in the morning. Then afternoon, I will come home. I need to start, um, I need to fix little thing of the, the ceiling. I need to fix the ceiling. I wanna paint it. Then I'm Teacher. gonna, yep. Excuse me, what's the missing? Cielo falso. Ah, okay. Thank you. Okay. Um, I need to fix some parts and I'm going to paint it. Lo voy a pintar and fix. And then perhaps I will paint the house. Let's see. And, hmm. I need to take the motorcycle to the workshop. Yo le voy a dar la moto al taller. I need to take both cars for the workshop. Y los dos vehículos. Ouch. That hurts. A lot of money, horse. teacher. A lot to expand. Very spend. Yeah, a lot, a lot of money to spend. To spend. Yeah. yeah. And I think, and I think, uh, and you will have a, a lot of time on vacation. Yeah, but you know, it's, it's sad because I just, Get the money and pass the money. Yeah, you know, it's, I, yeah, the it's, car, the car is a, like a, like a child, a daughter or, or son. Well, it depends the type of cars. Some of them are like a wife, you know. <laughs> Yeah, the thing is this, you know, the situation is this. Usually we just usually we just have one car. I mean, because it's a small family. And actually it was not needed. There was no need of another one. No necessary otro. It was just like a family car. And for me to go to work, 
I move in a motorcycle. But uh, my son, uh, he is in his third year at the university. And he needs to, to travel. The problem is that um, he got, he never, he was never going out alone. Él nunca salió solo. So now uh, we told him how to drive. He got his license. And he doesn't want to drive that car. No quiere manejar ese vehículo. He wants a, a cheaper one. Quiere uno but the motorcycle sencillo. is dangerous. Yeah, yeah, but no, the motorcycle is for me, just me. The motorcycle is just for me. Because uh, 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 I don't want him riding the motorcycle. Actually, last year I had an accident. I broke this hand. I broke this hand right here. And then I got I got it broken. You need to be more careful. And I got the, a crack on my hip. Una fisura en la cadera. I damaged a nerve on my arm. Un nervio dañado. And, and a couple of, of, you know, bumps and stuff. Un par de golpecitos, but it was funny. So, yeah, no, the motorcycle is just for me. I don't want him riding the motorcycle. No way, Jose. It's very dangerous. I don't like motorcycles, uh, teacher. I prefer car. More security. Yeah, yeah of course, of course. The only thing is that, I mean, in expenses, the motorcycle is cheap. Yeah. The only bad thing is when it rains. Ah, uh, when it rains, I suffer. Because you know, when it rains, you get wet. But I mean, yeah. So as I as I was telling you, my my vacation is going to be very busy. And it's going to be very expensive because all my savings are gonna tell me bye. All I'm very, I'm very busy too, teacher, on vacation. Yeah, a lot of all my yeah, all my savings gonna be gone. Savings, ahorros. Yeah, I know. All my the savings old... gonna it's gone. Yeah, yeah. I'm saying bye bye to my savings <laughs> because yeah. you. Must... Because and you must pay the fix. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And mechanics are expensive. <laughs> but what can we do? Hey, Carlos, nice talking to you. Welcome. Okay, teacher. Welcome. Hey, guys. Before we move on, let me get please the the attendance. Carlos Eduardo Artiga Barres. Let's see, Carlos Eduardo, Carlos Eduardo. Oh, it's here. Welcome, Carlos. Uh, Carlos Elibaldo Abrego Marmol. No, 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 no here. Edwin Alberto Rodriguez Lobo. Present teacher. Thank you, Edwin. Stephanie Lisette Molina Rodriguez. No, Stephanie. Gabriel Beltran Perez. Present teacher. Thank you, Gabriel. <laughs> Ingrid Beatriz Natalia Palacios Molina. Hmm. Ingrid, I'm here. Ivan Petrovich Guzman Aquino. Presence. Thank you, Mr. Ivan Echamile Dominguez Hernandez. Present teacher. Thank you. Uh, Yvette Lisset Figueroa de Calle. Present teacher. Thank you. Karen Beatriz Moratalla Segovia. 
Present. Thanks. Carla Lizette Garcia Lemus. Present teacher. Thank you, Carla. Luis Antonio Abrego Sarabia. Present teacher. Thank you, Mr. Magdaleno Escalante Orantes. Present teacher. Thank you, Mr. Maylene Janet Manzano Montoya. Present teacher. Thank you, Maylene. Nelson Antonio Rodas Rosales. Present teacher. Oscar Armando Romero Mendoza. Present teacher. Rosalina Alvarado. Present teacher. Thanks. Verónica Arelia Chala Ramírez. Wilfredo Arevalo Ortiz. Present teacher. Thank you. Xiomara Elizabeth Cisneros Rosales. Present. Thank you, Xiomara. Carlos Josué Chávez. Present teacher. Okie dokie. Let me see. All right. Well, let's continue. I got time right now. Let's see. Ivan Guzman. Hello. How are you, mister? Fine, teacher. I happy finish week in my job. <laughs> okay, that's cool. That's cool. That's a nice attitude. And tell very, me. Very, very happy. <laughs> how's the what's the plan for the weekend? What you got? Excuse me. What is the plan for the weekend? Ah, okay. Um, my plan is uh, I'm I go in um, a mountain, maybe. Oh, really? Maybe, maybe. Ooh. Where are you um, going? Um, um, quiero ver. Ruta de las Flores. Son okay, sonar. that's nice. Yeah, that's nice. Sí. Uh, in my family. Mm. With my family, with my family. With my family. Oh, okay, okay. So you like the 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 all the all this all the views. Beach. Views. 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 What's meaning views? La vista. Ah, sí, sí, I, I like views and the flowers, um, mountain, um, lakes. Uh, I, uh, I feel, uh, I feel, uh, I feel a uh, naturality. The nature, I feel the nature. I feel the nation. Okay. Okay, that's nice. That's nice, that's nice. And tell me, which is your favorite place on the on the Ruta de las Flores? Um, I don't know. Uh, I I don't I don't visit in, in in place. You have never visited? No, 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 no. Oh, it's the first time. At the first time is correct. Oh, that's nice. Okay, you will enjoy it. It's a very good experience. Sí, sí, sí. Yeah, I like it. I like it. You know, uh, I usually do it like this. I live in San Martin. I usually go to, well, it depends on the day. Sometimes what I do is that I go to, let's see. I go all to La Libertad. I take from La Libertad to Sonsonat, but from La Libertad to Acajutla by all the litoral. From Acajutla, I go to Sonsonate. From Sonsonate, I have taken it by Sonsacate and I have taken it by Los Naranjos. Uh, it's nice. I go up there. I come down by Santa Ana. And then I come back. Yeah. Uh, is, oh, uh, uh, so I feel a difference in, in, in the place. 
the cool, cool the weather. Ambient. Weather, weather, yeah. weather uh, is different. Yeah, the weather is different, very different. Sí, es very cool. Um, eh, I breathe, respirar. I breathe. Uh -huh, I breathe uh, pure. Air, pure air, air. Pure. air pure. Pure air. Pure air. Yeah, thank you, thank you. Pure air. Okay, that's nice, that's nice. Yeah, it's it's a very good experience. I recommend it to you. I, I am sure you and your family are going to enjoy it. And and in some places you got nice food. I see, see. I like food. Um uh, coffee? Coffee cup. A cup of coffee. Coffee cup a coffee. A cup, a cup of coffee. A cup of coffee. Okay. 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 Like this. Look. Um, yeah, you are saying it. Okay. A cup of coffee. Okay. Say it, please. Sí. Okay. Say it, please. Diga, please. A cup of coffee. Okay. Now, just one little thing. A little thing. So, una cosita chiquita. Okay. When you just have one F. Like in this case, cuando tenemos solo una F, the sound of that F in this case is like this. Om, om. It's not om. Oh. Om. Suena como una V. Om. Oh. Like that. A cup of coffee. A cup oh, of coffee. Yeah, a cup of coffee. The thing is this. Uh, I, you don't, say, I don't pronunciation if. De F. Lo que sucede es esto, la F, la F en este caso se pronuncia como V, mm. cuando okay. solo es una. Because if you say off, what you are saying is this. Off, off the apagado. Exactly, exactly. That's mm. the difference. Okay. Yeah, no, it's, it's interesting, right? Interesting. English yeah. is a beautiful language. Really? Yeah, it is. It is. Actually, it's a very, it's simpler. It's simpler than Spanish. Okay. It's easier. Well, Ivan, nice talking to you. What? I hope, nice talking to you. I hope you enjoy your vacation. I don't understand, teacher. Nice talking to you. I hope you enjoy your vacation. Si disfruto qué? No. Espero disfrute. I hope. I hope. Ah, okay. I hope. I hope you enjoy your vacation. Okay, viaje. Sí. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Okay. Well, thank you. Let's see who else is around. Rosalina, hello, how are you? How are you, teacher? I'm just fine, just fine. What about you? So tired, but I'm trying to the class and finish. Uh, trying to survive the class. Yeah, because uh, I will, no, I made uh, a lot of reports before uh, take a vacation and then it's so hard but it finished oh so you're on vacation yeah and this day is the last day that's, that's <laughs> great that's great now i got a phrase for you i got a phrase for you okay okay whenever you got uh before siempre que tenga before uh -huh. if you go on verbo después that verb must be with ing. Ese verbo va en la forma ing. Ah, okay. Before, before taking vacation. Before, uh -huh. yep. Taking, yeah, yeah, I got it. Uh -huh. be, before going, you see. Uh huh. 
Okay. Before You're drinking to... my coffee? Yeah. Yeah, bread, exactly. For example. Okay. I got the idea. Exactly like that. The same goes applies to after. After drinking coffee, uh -huh. I always drink water. Uh -huh. See? Okay. Like uh, after uh, after waking up, I take a shower. You mm -hmm. see? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now look at this one also. For for understanding this topic, you need to use it for understanding. So that means the regla is antes de algunas preposiciones, before, for, before, after, after, for, uh -huh. you place a verb. If you place a verb, that uh -huh. verb goes in ing form. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. It's, it's new for me, but it's, it's nice for better conversation. No? Mm -hmm. Actually, you are going to sound uh, more uh, more natural if you use it like this. Uh -huh. Okay. So you need to use it like that. Like uh, the same happens uh, with some verbs like uh, start, stop, Starting. like go. After these words, if you place another verb, that verb in ing. Ing, okay. Yeah, like right. I need to start. I need to start speaking faster to you, Rosalina. You see, yeah. I need to start speaking faster, and I need to stop using Spanish with you. Got okay. it? Yeah, I got it. I need to hey, stop. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. It's. It's very interesting, right? Yes, the grammar. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. But it's better when we apply it directly. That's the idea. So keep it in mind, keep it in mind. About it. Uh -huh. in so, Sabrina, a, yeah, a pleasure having you here. Welcome. Yeah, thank you. Yes. For me, it's a change no stay yesterday in the class, but yeah, you know, we miss mm -hmm. we were missing you yesterday. Nice having you Thank here. You. Welcome. Thank let's you. see. Let's see. Let's see. Um, do I have them? Yeah, I still got time. Talk to some of you. Got time for two more. Let's see. Hmm. So, Mailing, how are you? How are you doing? You doing better? Hello, teacher. Uh, a little bit. <laughs> a little bit? Oh, I'm so sorry. Thank you. So sorry that you are sick, but I am glad that you are doing a little bit better. I remember yesterday you were doing a little bit bad, right? Well, yes, I hope. <laughs> it's nice to have you here, Maylin. I hope you Thank enjoy you. the class. Welcome. Thank you, teacher. Oh, thanks to you. Thanks to you. Let's see. Where's uh? Where's 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 Who's going to be next? Ivania. Hello, Ivania. Oh, okay. Um, Oscar Armando. Hello, teacher. Hello, how are you? A uh, uh, little uh, occupation. First, I talk to uh, you uh, a moment. Okay. Okay. A little bit busy. No problem. No problem. No problem. I understand. Uh, this situation is quite different, right? Let's see. Let's see. I got time just for one more. I'm sorry. Let's see who's it going to be. There's people here that I haven't talked to yet. Maybe Gabriel. Yeah, Gabriel is here, I remember. Hello, Gabriel, how are you? Hello, teacher. 
Gabriel, your microphone. Hi, teacher. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you, mister? Um, fine. Um, uh, I am early. Okay, okay. And tell me, what's the plan for the weekend? Um, visit uh, family. Okay, okay. Now, let me share with you a word. Visit relatives. Okay. okay. Relatives. Well, because when you say family, when you say family, you refer to the people you live with. Okay? Or, I can, or you use it as a general term. But what I imagine is that you want to tell me familiares, right? Okay. Familiares, that's relatives. Okay? Usually when I refer to my family, I refer to, to the close family. Got it? Cuando soy family, me refiero a los cercanitos, los que viven conmigo, or very close, very close. Cuando or es as a general term. But if I want to say familiares, that's relatives. That rena. Relatives. Relatives. Okay. Thank that's you. Nice you. I hope you enjoy your trip. Welcome to the class, Gabriel. Um, ¿Cómo se dice por un momento? At the moment. At the moment. Uh, no, under, understand en English. Me cuesta entender. Oh, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. No, I told you, cuesta. I told you, welcome to the class. Okay. Yeah, no, it's nice having you here. Bienvenido a la clase. Como ar, uh, armar la, eh, la hora lo que me está diciendo y luego armar las respuestas es como que se me complica porque como son palabras las que todavía entiendo eh, pues trato no de armar worry. lo que usted ha dicho y después tengo que me cuesta un poquito contestar así don't worry don't worry just pay attention to the class no te preocupes presta la atención a la clase and we are going to be giving you what you need y le vamos a ir dando lo que necesita okay thank you teacher no 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 it's Part of the job, don't worry about it. A pleasure for me. Okay, guys, well, let's see. You know, there's a lot to do tonight and welcome all of you. I know that I wish I could have the time to be like speaking one-on-one, -on -one, and but I don't want it to take that much time. Now, next week, some days of next week, this activity is going to be different. And I will explain to you, well, not next week because next week is vacation, but right after vacation, when we come back in some classes, it's not gonna be me asking you, how are you? How was your vacation? Or how was your day? I'm going, next, next class, I'm going to divide you in groups. I'm going to assign one person of the group to ask the classmates. And the rest of you will be taking notes because I will ask some of you not about your activities. I will ask you about your classmates activity. Like imagine that uh, Ivan is working with Magdaleno. So uh, Ivan is going to tell me about Magdaleno's activities. They're going to be reporting to me, okay? The idea is that so you can uh, modify vocabulary you can modify structures that's the idea and that's what we are going to do but through practice to speak in practice okay because as i told you at the beginning i want you speaking uh, that's my goal i need you speaking so i know that it's a little bit hard for some of you we are gonna go slow but slow and still Vamos a ir lento, pero constante, okay so don't worry if it's hard for you it's okay Slowly, we are going to be, we're going to be getting the, the, the tools we need. 
So now, 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 let's see. Mm -hmm. We're gonna do an exercise. Do you remember the imperatives? Yesterday we were working with the imperatives. Oh, thank you, Ivan. Okay, yes, okay uh... now. Okay. Yeah? Tell me, tell me. Uh, no, uh, I say, um, uh, help you in, in your language. Yeah, I mean, that's the idea to help you to, to learn the language, to acquire the vocabulary. Okay, guys, well, let's see. Yesterday, if you remember, we were working using the imperatives. And imperatives is something very simple, right? Like start, push, uh, uh, we use it like at home with the kids, right? Like clean your room, do the dishes, okay? Our bosses use it with us, right? Something that it's very interesting, if you remember, is that uh, you can use it and you can add the word like please at the end. Please, it sounds like not that hard. Like uh, right now, uh, get your manuals, please. That's a command, right? Get your manuals. Please. Oh, you feel like it's different. It's different if I tell you, hey, Shimara, uh, get your manual. Shimara goes like, oh, that's strong. But if I say, get your manual, please. It sounds like a request, not like a command. Right? So keep that in mind. It's going to help us to, to to express ourselves better. But now we are going to talk about something that I love. And it's chocolate. Love chocolate. Let me share with you. We're gonna go to the mind now. We're going to page number 14. In the Insafer manual, you got in page, in page number 14, you got uh, use imperatives to give an order, to give instructions, or to make invitations, right? Imperatives do not have a subject. The examples we have is read this chart and check every piece. Fill in a report about the defective pieces. Unplug this cord and connect the blue one. Verify the oil level. Now the exercise. Look at the diagram of how this chocolate product is made. Label each step in order using the words in the diagram. Okay, so what do we have? Uh, we got this. We got separate, check, label, assemble, form, mix, ground. What are you going to do? You are going to place these words in these spaces here. Okay, how are we going to do it? Well. Working in pairs, well, in the small groups. So I'm going to send you to the groups. Remember, it's in page 15. If you got your manuals there, that's fine. And I'm going to send you to the groups. Let me just create a group right now. Okay, groups are created. Let's see. Yeah, that's fine, that's fine. And I'm gonna send you the screenshot to the group so you can check it out if you want. Four minutes, four minutes. Okay, let's go check them through. Okay. 
Veamos la del chocolate, las palabras. Ah, ok, sí, sí, sí es cierto. La primera ya está, dos, cuatro, lo que no entiendo es que solo hay siete. Entonces, sí, para que, se... Dos, cuatro, uh -huh. seis, siete. Entonces uh -huh. quizás uh -huh. se duplica uh -huh. esa de separate. Sí, es probable. Vamos, separate right. your right materials to get on. Se separan los materiales. Vaya, la siguiente dice los ingredientes the para hacer la Yo pienso que ahí quizás sería mix. Exactly. Yes. Mix uh, the ingredients. To... Ajá. Mix. Ok. Mm, mix en el bueno. Sí. Mix. Eh, veamos. Mix is the meaning the, of brown. Uh, brown. Into powder. Moler. Moler. Four. Ah, grown. Ah, entonces eso sería en la tres. Yeah, grind. Ground. No, grind. I'm sorry, ground, ground, ground. Ground, ok. Ground. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Moler, de ahí dice el power con leche. Sí, me assemble, com... assemble. No. Assemble. The power with milk. Assemble es mezclar. Oh, yeah. mezclar es mix. Mix, ah, mix, entonces es mix. Mix, you use it twice. Mix it with Mix the powder with mm, o separate the powder with milk. Separar el powder, no sé cuál es, molino de la leche. Veamos. Pues para mí, ¿qué sería como mix ahí también, verdad? No, no se yeah, repite eso. Mix, yep. mix, ajá. Mix the powder, the power, powder with milk, ajá, sí entonces la cuatro sería mix también luego de chocolate entonces ahí sí es assemble, porque es como empaquetar o algo así yep. ¿verdad? ajá, assemble la otra sería ah, sí, entonces sería perdón, ahí sería assemble de chocolate, yes. package to finish. Uh -huh. Ah, ok, ok. Después. No, sería básicamente. Word, the word mix, you use it five. Ok, the word mix, you use it two times. Ok, teacher. Thanks. So, ok, in the, in the second. Ok. What is the hey, level? The word, the word, the word mix, the word mix is used two times. Okay. Uh, could you repeat that, teacher, please? I the word, the word mix, the word mix, you use it twice. Oh, okay. Okay. Gracias, teacher. Entonces, en este caso, Magdaleno, podría ser mix también hasta la de la cuarta. Dice mix cuarta. powder with milk. Ajá. Yeah, it is. Sí. Mix. Uh, hey guys. Remember the word mix is used twice. La palabra mix se usa dos veces, ¿ok? Ah, ok. Grom teacher, ¿qué significa? What? Grom. Ground. Moler. Ground. Moler, vea. Ah, ya yes, se separa No. I am sorry to interrupt you guys, but Why? the word the word mix, you use it two times, okay? Twice. Twice. Okay. Yeah, mix, you use it in two different ones. Ah, okay. You see that? Viste, Iván? Hoy? Ah, vamos a usarlo en dos cosas. O sea, en el all the ingredients está operando. All the ingredients to make the chocolate tape. Ingredients. Ingredients. En medio. 
All the ingredients. No, Rosalina, the pronunciation. Ingredients. Ingredients. Like that. Ah, ingredients. Ah, and the second, the second sentence. Yeah. Yes. Okay, guys. Uh, I'll be back in a second. Okay, thank you, teacher. Mm -hmm. Dice really? que la palabra mix la vamos a usar en dos. No solo en mm -hmm. una. ¿Ah? Entonces yeah. puede ser esta. Uh -huh. All the ingredients. Cocoa beans. Mm -hmm. ¿Ah? Uh -huh. O el polvo con la leche. ¿Qué significa ground? Ground es terrestre. No, hombre, ground. Sí. Terrestre. Sí, es raro. Porque la última tiene que ser check. Ponele check. Checking, check quality in quality control. Checar y revisar, ¿verdad? Checker. Package. Así, a simple pass. Paquete, dice. El que package, sí. Package uh -huh. es paquete. Por eso. Vas a ponerle la viñeta al paquete de, de volado. ¿ve? Entonces sería. Chocolate, Rosalina. Package. Chocolate. Uh -huh. No volado, chocolate. Package. 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 No. <laughs> Bye, este, okay. One minute, one minute. Yeah, okay, okay. Okay. Pongámosle mix al de cocoa bean cinto. Voy a poner, oh. pongámosle. Va. Uh -huh. Vaya, nos va quedando ground. Ground. Okay, let's bring everybody back.
Okay, let's see everybody's coming back in a few seconds. Let's just wait. Hello, teacher. Hello, Carlos. We're just waiting for your classmate. Hello, from for a bit. It's very hot, teacher. Yeah, it is, it is. Okay, everybody's here. Let's do the exercise. Okay, guys, let's see, let's see. We got the receipt for chocolate and how they do it in a factory. So let's see, the first one says, separate the raw materials to get only the best cocoa beans. Now, Antonio Rodas, tell me which is next one. Mix all the ingredients to make the chocolate the chocolate table. Okay. We got mix all the ingredients. 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 Thank you, mister. Okay, Oscar Armando, next one. Ah, uh, teacher, the ground. Okay, next one. The powder. Oh, perfect, just perfect. Ground the cocoa beans into powder, 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 powder. Okay, excellent, excellent. Ivan, next. Ivan. Excuse me, I I need to mute. Okay, microphone. no problem, no problem. Um, uh, the third mix the powder with milk. Just perfect. Thank you, Mister. Mix the powder with milk. Now let's see, Xiomara, what you got in next? Uh, assemble. Assemble. Assemble the okay. chocolate package to finish. That's perfect. Thank you. Assemble. Now, next one. Uh, Wilfredo. Okay. Yes, see. Before this. Okay. Form. Form a simple paste. Perfect. Rosalina, next one. Label the package. Label oh. the package. <laughs> Perfect. Label the package. And the last one. Let's see who's going to do it. Carla Lisset. Check quality in quality control. Okay, perfect. Check quality in quality control. Perfect, well done. So you got 
Separate the raw materials to get only the best cocoa bean. Mix all the ingredients to make the chocolate table, tablet. Ground the cocoa beans into powder. Mix the powder with milk. Assemble the chocolate package to finish. Form a simple paste. Label the package. Check quality in quality control. Okay, guys, let's see. I'm sorry, but I need to get the second attendance. Time flies. Carlos Eduardo Artiga Barrios. Uh, Carlos Elivaldo Abrego Marmol. Edwin Alberto Rodriguez Lobo. Present teacher. Thank you. Stephanie Lizette Molina Rodriguez. Yes. Gabriel Beltrán Pérez. Present teacher. Ingrid Beatriz Natalia Palacios Molina. Ivan Petrovich Guzman Akin. Present. Ivania Echamilet Domínguez Hernández. Ivet Lisset Figueroa de Calles. Present teacher. Thank you. Karen Beatriz Morataya Segovia. Present. Thanks. Carla Lisset García Lemos. Present. Luis Antonio Abrego Sarabia. Present. Magdaleno Escalante Orantes. Present, teacher. Thank you. Maylin Shenet Manzano Montoya. Present, teacher. Nelson Antonio Arrodas Rosales. Present, teacher. Oscar Armando Romero Mendoza. Present teacher. Rosalina Alvarado. Present teacher. Verónica Arelia Echala Ramírez. Wilfredo Arevalo Ortiz. Present teacher. Xiomara Elizabeth Cisneros Rosales. Present. En Carlos Josué Chávez. Present teacher. Thank you very much. Okay, guys, next exercise. Okay. The questions to consider are what type of equipment is there at your company? Do you use it? Why? Okay, these two questions you are going to consider it with your classmates, okay? What type of equipment is there at your company? Do you use it? Yes or no? Why? Okay, so. You're gonna be working again with groups, giving me the answer to that question, okay? Guys, groups are open, jump in. Go check the groups. Yes, I'm not solo, teacher. Maybe, uh, let's maybe see. I'm along. Okay, let's fix this. Hola, hola. Eh, oh, that's Elvin. Me he activado the microphone. Ah, okay. Okay. Okay, okay Edwin. 
Do you where you where where do you work? Where do you work? Teacher. Yes. Tell me. Um, una consulta. Y vamos a contestar la pregunta, ¿verdad? What type of equipment is there at your company? First, mm -hmm. do you use it? Why? Yes. Y después nos vamos a pasar al diálogo. No. No, no. The conversation no, okay. no yet. Ah, okay. okay. Thank you, teacher. Okay. My company computed. And you, Gabriel? Take a tip of the keep um, for okay, um, is detect metal detector, una máquina detectora de metal. Is... Pala, teacher, how, how do you say pala? Bravo. Could you write that, please? Shovel, material. Yeah, shovel. There is a shovel. There is a shovel. We're finished, teacher. Great, great. We're just going to wait for everybody to be back. Teacher, mire, una pregunta. Ayer me yeah, sure. una pregunta, pero usted no especificó, o sea, la otra semana, que es que completa no vamos a recibir clases. Yes, haven't you checked on the WhatsApp? No, me he revisado el WhatsApp, ¿verdad? Ahí les mandaron un mensaje hoy. 
Sí, te quiero decir de, de, del 1, bueno, del primero, sería los 5 días que damos en clase hasta el 8, ¿verdad? Exactly. Ah, ok. Perfecto, teacher. No problem, no problem. But, but, let's, uh, I will try to send you guys a little bit of exercises so you can practice something. Voy a tratar de enviar un ejemplo para que practiquen during, during the week. Ok, teacher. Let's see, everybody's here. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Edwin. Hello, Edwin. How are you? Edwin Alberto. Well, let's see. Magdalena, tell me. Got a question for you. Uh, what type of equipment is there at your company? Well, in, at your church. <laughs> okay, in my church, we have uh, some some tools, maybe a, a hammer. Um, I don't know what is. Uh, um, uh, a ladro. Drill. Drill. A hammer, drill, and some tools, um, uh, either that. Okay, perfect, thank you. Okay, guys, let's see, let's see. Drill, drill. Okay, we'll go back to the manual. Here in the manual, we have the conversation. And the instruction is, listen to your teacher, read the conversation, then practice with a form. Okay, guys. So the conversation goes as follows. Berta, do you think that our company should improve the manufacturing process? I believe so. Why do you ask? Because if we do so, we reduce costs. I see. I think that we should do what other companies are doing. And that is getting new equipment. I mean, we should not have the same machines with the same programs. We should be in the 21st century. Right. Maybe we should talk about that in the next meeting. I repeat. Berta, do you think that our company should improve the manufacturing process? I believe so. Why do you ask? Because if we do so, we reduce cost. I see. I think that we should do what other companies are doing. And that is getting new equipment. I mean, we should not have the same machines with the same programs. We should be in the 21st century. Right. Maybe we should talk about that in the next meeting. Okay, guys, four minutes to practice. You're going to be working again in groups of two or three members. So let's practice switch, switch turns, okay?
creo que es M. Se pronuncia. Equipment. Getting equipment. new equipment. Yep, equipment. Getting new equipment. I mean, we should not have the same should. machine. Should. 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 We should not have the same machines with the same programs. We should be in. Join. Join you. In the 21st, 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 21st century. Right, right. Maybe we should talk about that in the next meeting. So it's time to bring everybody back. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's see who's gonna be first. <laughs> Okay, Antonio Rodas en Carlos Chávez. Okay, this Antonio, you uh, start. Can you share okay. it? Uh, can, you, can you share the picture, teacher, please? Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm ready. Okay. Berta, do you think that our company should improve the manufacturing process? I believe so. What do you ask? Because if we do so, we reduce cost. I see. I think that we should do what other companies are doing. And that is? Getting new equipment. I mean, we should not have the same machine with the same programs. We should be 
in the 21st century. Right. Maybe we should talk about that in the next meeting. Okay. Talk. 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 And guys, should. 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 Sure. La L, no, la L no tiene sonido antes de la D. Should, 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 should. Like that, should. Okay. Perfect, thank you very much. Now, okay. Elwin Alberto and Gabriel Beltran. Okay. Elwin, you start. Yes. I believe so. We, do you ask? No, 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 no. Okay. Just, just start. Elwin, you are Peter. ¿Qué teacher? Comienzo yo, si quieres. Me desconectó el, 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 la aplicación. Si gusta que empiece él y yo le sigo. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Okay. Berta, do you think that our company should improve the manufacturing process? I believe so. Uh, we do you ask? Because if we do so, we reduce costs. I see. I think that we should do what other companies are doing. And that is? Getting a new equipment. I mean, we should no, have the same machines with design programs. We should be in the 21st century. Right, maybe we should talk about that in the next meeting. Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. Just remember guys, why, why doing equipment equipment okay thank you excellent now let's see uh, 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 that was um... now ivan and yvette okay ivan you start okay yeah berta do you think that our company should employ the manufacturing process Oh, pardon. I believe I believe it so. Why do you ask? Oh, because if we do so, we reduce costs. I see. Uh, I think that we should do what other companies are doing. Oh, and, uh, and there is? Getting new equipment. Equipment, I mean, equipment, I mean, I mean, we should not have the same machines with the same programs. We should be in the 21st century. 21st century. Oh, pardon, 21st century. Right, maybe we should talk about the, the next meeting. Okay, perfect. Now, uh, Yvette, remember, uh, should, 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 same, same. Now, uh, Ivan, should talk. You talk. You talk. You talk. What what is where is war? You talk. Ah, okay. You talk. Okay. Now let's see. Thank you guys. Karen and Carla. Okay. Uh, Karen, you start. 
Berta, do you think that our company should improve the manufacturing process? I believe so. Why do you ask? Because if we do so, we reduce cost. I see. I think that we should do what other companies are doing. And that is? Getting new equipment. I knew if we should not have the same machine with the same program, we should be in the 21st century. Right. Maybe we should talk about that in the next meeting. Perfect, guys. Just remember, equipment, equipment, century, century. Okay. Luis Abrego and Magdalena, ready? Yes, teacher. Okay, Magdalena, you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay, Luis, you start, Luis. Okay, teacher. Berta, do you think that our company should improve the manufacturing process? I believe so. Why do you ask? Because if we do so, if we reduce cost. Ah, I see. I think that we should do what the other. Um, I see. I think that we. Ah, I see. I think that we should do what other companies are doing. And that is? Getting new equipment, I mean. We should not have the same machines with the same programs. We should be in the 21st century. Right. Maybe we shall talk about that in the next meeting. Okay. Okay, guys, perfect. Just remember, uh, equipment, equipment, improve, improve and reduce. Okay, Maylin and Rosalina. Ready, ladies? Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay, Maylin, just start. Berta, do you think that our company should improve should improve the manufacturing process? I believe so. What do you ask? Because is we just to so we reduce cost. I see. I think that we should do what other companies are doing. And that's it. That is, that's it. That's it. Getting new equipment. I mean, we should not have the same machines with the same programs. We should be in the 21st century. Right. Maybe we should to talk about that in the next meeting. They finish. Talk. I'm sorry. Just remember, Maylin. Talk. 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 Okay, perfect. Now, Wilfredo and Xiomara. Wilfredo, you start. Do you think that our company should improve the manufacturing process? I believe so. Why do you ask? Because if we do so, we reduce costs. I see. I think that we should do what, what other companies are doing. And that is. 
getting new equ equipment, I mean, we should not have the same machines with the same programs. We should be in the 21st century. Why? My niece should talk, talk about that in the next meeting. Okay, 21st, 21st. Let me repeat it one more time for you guys. Berta, do you think that our company should improve the manufacturing process? I believe so. Why do you ask? Because if we do so, we reduce costs. I see. I think that we should do what other companies are doing. And that is getting new equipment. I mean, we should not have the same machines with the same programs. We should be in the 21st century. Right. Maybe we should talk about that in the next meeting. Okay, guys. Well, very well done. Now, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. I got something else prepared for you. Okay, what do we have here? Should or shouldn't? Now, let's remember, when do we use should? Ah, oh, we use it to express something that is a good or positive idea. Like, children should eat fruits every day. That's positive, right? Shouldn't, something that is a bad or negative idea. Children shouldn't eat junk food every day. Look, shouldn't, no deberían. So, this is Mark. He has a stomachache. He should or shouldn't, guys? Shouldn't. Okay. In this case, you're right. He he shouldn't shouldn't eat candies today. He number two, somebody else again. Number two, should should or shouldn't should 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 should. Okay, perfect. Should he should take medicine? Number three, should or shouldn't. Shoot. Shoot again. Oops. Teacher, uh, what is the difference? Pronunciation? Deveria, no deveria. Uh... Should, shouldn't. Excuse me? Should, shouldn't. Shouldn't, neg negative. Yep. Shouldn't. I don't know, perhaps it's soon that you don't listen quite okay. Should, shouldn't. Okay, next exercise. Should, shouldn't. Okay. Next, this is Maggie. She has a broken leg. So again, guys, you or shouldn't. Should. Okay, perfect. She should raise at home. Next one. Somebody else? Shouldn't. She shouldn't. Shouldn't. She shouldn't. She shouldn't in the park. Exactly. She shouldn't jump, jump in the park. And the last one? 
She shouldn't play soccer. She shouldn't play soccer. Play soccer. Yeah, of course, because she has a broken leg. So she should rest at home. She shouldn't jump in the park. And she shouldn't play soccer. Very well done. Okay, these are Alex and Wanda. It's raining outside today. Should or shouldn't? Shouldn't. They shouldn't they play, should. also, play outside today. Okay. They shouldn't play outside today. Excellent. Next one. They should, should or shouldn't? Bring something home. Perfect, mister. Perfect. They should drink something hot. And the last one? They uh, should. They should. They should wear a raincoat. Yes. They should wear a raincoat if, you, if they go out. <laughs> they should wear a raincoat if they go out. Perfect, guys. Very well done. Raincoat. 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 Rain, no, it's raincoat. Yep, exactly. Uh -huh. A jacket. Jacket, impermeable, a jacket. Uh -huh. Okay, guys. That's the grammar explanation. Okay, now. If you notice, should expresses uh, like suggestions, right? But now, um, and it's also used to express if something is right or wrong. Now, I got a problem, guys. Well, actually, I got I got three different problems. Tengo tres problems. And you guys are going to help me. I'm sorry, my, my camera disconnect something, it's my bow. Perdón que la cámara me está dando un problemita. Okay, let's see. So, I have three different problems. The first problem I got is that uh, my car, look, my car is, It's leaking oil. My car is leaking oil. Okay, the group number one is Antonio Rodas, Karen Beatriz, Carla Lucet, Oscar Armando, and Wilfredo Arevalo. Guys, you are going to give me suggestions. Ustedes van a dar sugerencias. To solve that problem. Para resolver ese problema. What is it that you're going to do? ¿Qué van a hacer? You're going to give me sentences using you should or you shouldn't, okay? You can use positive and negative. Second group is Carlos Jose Chavez, Gabriel Beltrán, Yvette Figueroa, Magdalena Escalante, and Rosalina Alvarado. Okay, guys, the problem I got is this. Uh, my wife is mad at me. La señora está enojada. My, my wife. wife is bad. My, so, guys, help me, help me. You gotta help me, okay? You are gonna give me suggestions. Got it? Now, group number three Edwin, Ivan, Luis Abrego, Maylin, Xiomar. Okay. Yours is easy. Yours is easy, okay? Uh, there is nobody home. No hay nadie en casa. There is nobody home. Okay? My problem is this. I cannot... I cannot uh, cook at all. Yo no sé cocinar nada. Nothing. Like nothing. I cannot cook. Uh, 
that's a big well i can prepare i can prepare the tuna you know but that's as far as it goes with me okay guys so i got those three problems you are going to give me at least five suggestions okay affirmative Hi. or negatives yes between affirmative or negative Entre affirmativas y negativas, it's up to you i want five sentences per group okay so remember the problems are my car is kicking oil my wife is mad at me and i cannot cook i'm hungry okay got it guys questions five positive and uh, five negative no 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 five total okay excellent question nobody else okay guys let's jump in you will have let's see seven minutes Edwin, what happened? Go out. Uh, teacher. Yep. Um, the phrase go out puede usarse para, invi uh, para invitar a alguien a salir. O cuál es el phrase que se usa para eso? Take, take her or him out. Uh, no lo entendí. No, no, no. Take. Take. Uh -huh. Take. Take okay. out. Uh, take out. Okay, maybe uh, you should take out dinner. You should take out. Ah, ah, ah. Now, now, separate. <coughs> okay, let's do something, guys. I'm sorry. El domingo. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Perdón. 
There's so much noise. I'm sorry. Just for a second, I will have you mute. Solo lo voy a silenciar por un instante, okay? Take out. Separate. Take her out. out. Take her out. My apologies. Perdón que lo silencié, pero it was a little bit hard. You can, you can, uh, can you unmute? Pueden activarlo, ¿no? Okay. Check it out. Okay, perfect. You, in this case, well, uh, in this case, is, uh, you should take her out. Perfect. Yeah, you should take her out for dinner, perhaps. For dinner. Yeah. Sí, for dinner. Be writing down. Look, like guys, all the homework you have you sent to me, written. Todas las tareas que me han enviado escrita. This weekend, I'm going to check them. Este fin de semana lo reviso, okay? And I will send them back with corrections. Okay. So write it down because you're going to send me that info per group, one per group. Oh, yeah, I remember. Yeah. Okay. The, uh, the next. Yeah. Guys, remember, you got to write it down because you're going to send it to me. Lo van a escribir because you're going to send it to me. One per group. One per group, uno por group, okay? Okay, the teacher, no. I have a question. No, yes, sure. sure. Uh, how to say taller because I- Workshop. I found workshop. Okay, thank you, teacher. Now, so it's remember, okay. all, all the activities you are sending to me, I will check them this weekend, okay? Las que me han enviado, no se preocupen que no las he regresado porque I haven't checked them yet. Aún no los he revisado, but this weekend I will. Este fin de semana lo haré, okay? Okay, okay teacher. Thank you. Workshop. Work, workshop. Lo quiere cinco, incluyendo negativas y positivas. Sí. Yeah. Cinco negativas y cinco positivas. No, five total, I said. Yo le mencioné a, a Meni, creo, le dije. Five total, cinco en total. Okay. Okay. Now, now, remember something, little something, guys. Perdón, voy a pausar un momento. Uh, all the activities that you're sending to me, I will check them. Todas las que me han enviado las voy a revisar, but this weekend, okay? Pero el fin de semana, because during the weekdays, it's a little bit hard for me sometimes. Se me hace un poquito duro, but this weekend I'm going to check them. Now, take notes because this one you are going to send it to me, one per group, okay? Así que tomen notas. You got two minutes. Any question? Uh, vamos a hacer cinco por grupo. Yep. Okay. Y, y te las vamos a enviar. Sure. Okay, that's right. Okay, let's see. We're just waiting for everybody to come back. Hmm. 
How do you like the exercise, Jose? Carlos? Terminamos todo. We are finished. How do you like the exercise? ¿Qué le parece el ejercicio? Ah, sí, está entretenido. Very interesting. Uh, it is, right? Because I'm married. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's it's hard. Sometimes it is hard. Sometimes it's very difficult. Yeah, it's normal. It's normal. But it's fun. It's the spice of life. Es lo que le da sabor a la vida. Yes. If it were easy, eh, it would be too boring. <clears throat> if it was easy, it would be too boring. Okay, guys, let's see. I don't have time to listen to all the five sentences, but let's see. Um, Carla, tell me one of the sentences you got for me. Okay, teach. You should take it to the workshop. Okay, yeah, because my car was broken down. Excellent, thank you very much. Okay. Now let's see. Rosalina, help me out. I'm in trouble. I have a big problem. Help me out. Remember that my wife is mad at me. What yes. should I do? Um, let me see. You should uh, mm -hmm. take out for dinner. Take her out. Take her out for dinner. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Thank you. Okay. Now let's see. Maylene, help me out. No. Uh, you should, should order for fast food. Fast, fast food. Mm -hmm. That's the easy way out, right? That is the easy way out. Es la salida fácil. That is the easy way out. That's the meaning of that phrase. Esa es la salida fácil. Okay, guys. Oh, interesting. Good suggestion. Don't forget, you need to send them to me. One per group, okay? One person, one member per group is going to send me the information. Now, guys, let me get the final attendance because believe it or not, time has flown. Yes, Magdaleno? Uh, teacher, I have a doubt. Uh, where do you, where do you want to uh, send uh, the homework? And What's up? Private? Private? Yeah, uh, in this, no, 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 in this case, public. In the group. In the group. Yeah, okay. in the group. Thank you very much. Good question, good question. Okay, Carlos Eduardo Artiga Barrios. Carlos Elibaldo Abrego Mármol. Edwin Alberto Rodríguez Lobo. Present teacher. Stephanie Lisset Molina Rodríguez. Eh, Gabriel Beltrán Pérez. Present teacher. Ingrid Beatriz Natalia Palacios Molina, Ivan Petrovich Guzman Aquino. Presents. Thank you. Ivania Chamile Dominguez Hernández. Yvette Lisette Figueroa de Calles. Present teacher. Karen Beatriz Morataya Segovia. Present. Carla Lisette García Lemos. Present. Luis Antonio Abrego Sarabia. Present teacher. Magdaleno Escalante Orantes. Present teacher. Maylin Janet Manzano Montoya. Present. Nelson Antonio Rodas Rosales. Present, teacher. Oscar Armando Romero Mendoza. Present, teacher. Rosalina Alvarado. Present, teacher. 
Verónica Arelí y Echela Ramírez. Wilfredo Areval Ortiz. Present teacher, good night. Xiomara Elizabeth Cisneros Rosales. Present. Carlos Josué Chávez. Present teacher, good night, everybody. Okay. Guys, I hope you enjoy your weekend and your vacation. I'm going to see you remember the eight. I'll try to send you something during the week so you can practice. Voy a ver qué les logro enviar durante la semana para que puedan practicar, okay? A pleasure. Hope to see you soon. Have a good night. Take care. Good night, teacher. Okay. Good night, teacher. Thank you. Thank you. Good night. 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 Take care. Oh, come on, Wilfredo. No, Xiomara. You were supposed to be with me tonight, Xiomara. What happened?
Oh. It's time. Your publication, guys. Take care.